there maybe? Let me know if it's too quiet. I had it, I had it perfectly set. I should have checked my settings before I uninstalled the previous game. Let me know if this is acceptable. Oh no, it begins. Well, Solus is in the jar and you can crush him with bits if you want. If you want to crush him with bits, you may. Let's make a shepherd. <sighs> Let's make a shepherd. Crush on egg, I mean crush egg. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. Here we go. Fucking hell with the core goes. Alliance military database. Classified information requested. Hi. Establishing secure connection. Secure connection confirmed. Oh. Chrysalis. I would like to enter new ID. Okay. How do I want to do this? Yes. What, what, what? No, 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 no. Right, okay, here's my thought process. Let me... Let, oh my god, the egg is gone. Let me run my my thought process. So I want to do a self-insert, but are we going to go... cis male, or are we going to go like... I want to do trans male, right? So I'm trying to decide whether I want to do trans male or trans male. This is more anatomically correct. However, the pronouns will be wrong. Um, however, this is more correct. But the pronouns will be wrong. And I'm just trying to decide whether I care about that. We do... The reason that I want to do the female body though is because it's Krem's voice actor. Which I think is just better. Will you feel comfortable being misgendered for the entire trilogy? I can just pretend that they're not doing it. I can just pretend like they're not doing it. Krem's voice actor though. We can, we can play it like... I get misgendered every fucking day and I correct them. I'll just correct everyone who uses my pronouns wrong. Uh, he, thank you. He. It'll be good fucking practice for me. Let's do it. Please log in to access your profile. We're not going to name him after me, per se, because that's too much. Like, to name him Edmund would be too much of a self-insert, so we're going to go for my middle name instead. A uh, nice androgynous name. My original shepherd was just called Jay. So we'll call him James, J for short. Uh, I am not romancing Caden. So don't worry about that. We are romancing no one. This is who we are romancing. 
We are romancing no one. Shall we just name him Jay? Shall we just keep Jay as like, or do we want the full? Do we want the full James? The true path. He's looking respectfully at Morden. Ace playthrough. Let's go! <laughs> you just like Jay? Kind of like Jay. I kind of just like Jay as well. This was my original Morden's... Uh, Morden's. <laughs> this is my original Shepherd's name was just the letter J. It could be short for James, but everybody calls him J. Let's do it. J, 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 Cool, 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 cool. What the fuck was that? Oh, okay. I hear you guys. Warning. I hear you. Data corruption detected. Please reconstruct profile. Confirm pre-service history. Oh, shit. That's right. Uh, oh, don't worry, Asylum. I have full faith in myself that I can get through without romancing anyone. Both of your parents were in the Alliance military. Your childhood was spent on ships and stations as they transferred from posting to posting, never staying in one play one location for more than a few years, following in your parents' footsteps. You, well, I don't have parents, so. Colonist. You were born and raised in Mindwar, a small border colony in the Attican Traverse. When you were 16, slavers raided the place, slaughtered your family and friends. You were saved by a passing alliance patrol and you enlisted with the military a few years ago. That sounds about right. Or just, you know, earthborn. Well, I am earthborn. Orphan because your relatives are dead to you. That's what I was thinking. So literally, this is exactly me. I am earthborn. I am technically. I'm estranged, but orphan. You were an orphan raised on the streets of the great metropolis seas, covering earth. You escaped the life of petty crime and underworld gangs by enlisting with the Alliance military when you turned 18. Yeah, fuck it. Confirm psychological profile. I, I did Soul Survivor last time. I remember. I remember Soul Survivor. My Canon Shepherd is an Earthborn Soul Survivor, so you know all the trauma by the end of Mass Effect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. During your service uh, mission, you were, yeah, I remember doing Soul Survivor, War Hero. Early in your military career, you found yourself facing an overwhelming enemy. You risked your own life to save your fellow soldiers. Then defeat the enemy despite the impossible odds. Your bravery and heroism have earned you medals and recognition from the Alliance fleet. Ruthless! Throughout your military career, you have held fast to one basic rule. Get the job done! Nah. Uh, what do you reckon, guys? For me, personally. Enjoy your lurk! I have zero chill about our boys. Yeah, me too, babe. Me too. Maybe too, an interesting experience roleplay wise. Could be. Like when I stood up against he who must not be named. <laughs> he wasn't very ruthless though, he was pretty. No, not ruthless. Uh, an overwhelming enemy foe. He wasn't all that overwhelming. Good night, Jinty. Have a good one. Soul Survivor though. Soul Survivor is kind of like, mm, I've done this one. Be the hero you are, Ed Boy. You're such a babe. Confirm military specialization. I was a vanguard and I never used my magic. I remember. Can today be over? We're trying. We're trying to get it for you. Engineers are tech specialists using the holographic Omnitool. They can um, 
decrypt security systems, repair or modify technical equipment, disrupt enemy weapons or shields. Oh no. Adepts are biotic specialists. Infiltrator, combine combat and tech to specialise in killing or disabling enemies at long range. You didn't use it once? Not once. Not once. I was literally just a soldier, if I remember correctly. Like, I thought it would be good. I think I switched from Vanguard to Soldier, did I not? Sentinel magic and tech? You ran the whole thing like a soldier? Yeah, I'm just going to run it like a soldier then. Because uh, if that's the case, if I naturally ran it as a soldier, I'm just going to run it as a soldier. Confirm facial identification. I would like to do that, thank you. Change appearance, please. Hooray! Right, so... Oh god, I forgot about this weird thing. No, no, look at me. No, no. Oh god. Oh, fuck. Oh. Mm. No, look, look at me. Look, no. Fuck. Look. Look at... No, stop. Oh god. Oh. Oh, it's Captain Jane Wave. Look at me. Look at... Look at me. No. Look. No, look. Look. Fuck. Okay, 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 okay. Don't move. Fuck it, I'll build her. Him. I'm a space mage, proceeds not to use space magic. Literally me. That's literally what happened. I'll take the space mage and, and gun thing and I can be like a battle mage. No, just gun. Only gun. Only gun. <laughs> build a bitch. Facial structure. Uh-oh. I don't want to build me per se, but complexion, freckles, 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 freckles. Uh, this is the reason, this is the reason why I don't b like self insert. I hate self inserting. No, no, look. No, seriously, I hate this. Why is this a thing? Stop, 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 stop. Look here. Look here. Look right here. Oh, God. Oh, neck thickness. This is important. Neck thickness. Nailed it. Actually. <laughs> no space magic. Only gun. That's pretty much how I played it. Let's put some kind of halfway thickness. You know? Gotta have some face size. Oh. I've oh, got to have some of that double chin. I have some double chin going. I'm alright with it. Too much? Too much double chin. Not enough? Need more double chin? God, can I get, her, get him to look? There we go. Nailed it. Getting, uh, getting, getting used to it now. Right, what's all this? Please? Cheek gaunt? I have a wee bit of gaunt. I'll, I'll take a wee bit of gaunt, please. Can he see it for shit? Oh no, fuck. Look at me. Look, 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 look. Here, please. For the love of everything. Hold on. Oh, okay. Ear size. Ear is fine. Ear orientation. Uh, gay. My favourite thing about engineer is having AI hacking. Yeah, I never use it. I personally play Infiltrator. Because I like to use the snipey snipes. Yeah, I never use the... <laughs> Big guns, please. Big guns for me, please. 
I would like more cheek gone. But not too much more. Oh god. He's gonna look awful, isn't he? Right, we, we need to fix this mouth. Mouth shape. Pissed off. And gay. Where's gay pissed off? Pouty? Pouty? I like Pouty. Pouty's good. Hello buddy! Welcome back to... Uni tries to build a character in Mass Effect and, and hates this head movement thing. Okay. Bit Pouty? Sigh. Space boyfriend. <laughs> Me and Garrus on sniping dates. Oh, you guys! Bit Pouty. I'm alright with that. Uh, right. Eyes. I shape. I do have big eyes, the way. Too big? Too, too big? I need them somewhere on the green spectrum. Green enough? Green enough. <laughs> Dr. Chuck was? Hacksaw. It's an, it's an anagram of Hacksaw. It's Chuck was. Nose is very important to me. No shape. Perfect. No, not too big. Cool, cool, cool. That one. I've got a bit of a schnoz on me. Oh, it's perfect. It's almost exactly my schnoz. I like my nose. Nose is good. How is everyone? Missed you guys. We missed you too, buddy. How are you doing? He looks cute so far, to be honest. Mm, there's too much gaunt there. Look at that. We need to bring that gaunt back. So let's go back to head. Bring that gaunt back. Oh, I don't like... Uh... Thank you, Moon. That's very fucking kind of you to say. Uh... It's very fucking kind of you to say. I wish I could see a little bit more. I'm worried about the gaunt. So let's just bring the gaunt all the way out, maybe. It'll be okay. No, it's going to be there regardless. So let's put a little bit of gaunt in. I have a smidge of gaunt. I want to, I want to look slightly tired. Be sure to check out... Oh yeah, be sure to check out Cracking Dice, guys. Right, back to eyes. Constantly startled. That's me. Uh, height, width, width. Yeah, bring them in a little bit. My eyes are quite close together. Like, suspiciously close. My eyes are suspiciously close together. They've been incredibly kind. They have been incredibly kind to us. Yep, this is pretty much. Yep, that's that's. Yep, that's pretty much me. That's the guy. Uh, nose, hair. Well, let's go through the hair, shall we? Hair colour first. I need like a kind of ready brown. Or I could just dye my fucking hair and say fuck it. There are no good colours. That's an interesting colour. That one. That's it. Ow. Fuck. That's the face! <laughs> JB looking like a snack though, you think? I think it's a little bit... Mm. Is that too brown? Do I need it redder? I cannot see. My glasses are... My eyes are dim. My cat... Bald. Bald. 
My eyes are dim, I cannot see. I have not brought my specs with me. I think that's the one that I went with originally. I think it was one of those ones that my original hawk had. One of the Janeway ones. redeemed it. Who, who redeemed? All right, game. In prophase, you see chromatins condensed to chromosomes. In metaphase, their centromeres align to make new homes. Glycine vase. <laughs> they all are aliphatic, so you will not see a ring. For species, you have arginine, lysine, and histidine. From protein, we are formed. Tryptophan and tyrosine and phenylalanine. Aspartic and glutamic are both acids, as we've seen. That one. But also glutamine. From protein, we are formed. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Thank you for your time. Thank you. You know what? Fuck it. Let's celebrate. She is the Krogan Queen. Hurrah, hurrah for the Krogan Queen. And it is, it is a glorious thing to be the Krogan Queen. I am the very model of a scientist, Solarian. I study species Turian, Asari, and Batarian. I'm quite good at genetics as a subset of biology because I am an expert, which I know is a tautology. My xenoscience studies range from urban to agrarian. I am the very I'm very happy right now. I didn't realize I was going to be this happy, but here I am being the happy. Guys, what do my fucking eyebrows look like? They're very thin, but not those ones. No. Maybe those ones? They're a bit chunk. Oh, this is why I hate doing self inserts. It's fine. No, I'll do that one. It's fine. I don't care. Brow color. I think we're good for brow color. Pink. I think we're good for brow color. I'm quite good at genetics as a subset of biology because I am an expert, which I know is a tautology. My xenoscience studies range from urban to aquarian. I am the very model of a scientist solarian. Blush. Off. Lip color. Oh, hello. Aff. Eyeshadow color. Give me the smokiest eye you've got. Give me. I demand smokier. Oh. Oh. Aha. That one. Perfect. I do do that. Which Origins class are you picking? I picked Soldier, uh, War Hero, Earthborn. Thank you, Jen. Is this my code? Scars! Oh. 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 Because I can add a little something to my character. Fuck it. I'm a war hero for crying out loud. Gotta have something. I don't know if I've actually got any scars on my face. <gasps> Morden! 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 What happened, son? 
He's fine. He's fine, ladies and gentlemen, the non binaries. He's fine. Chicks dig scars, exactly. I'm thinking that one. We're going to do the squall. Or is it the cipher one? It's the squall one. We're going to go squall. My homage to Final Fantasy. Too bad the scars don't appear in Mass Effect 2 and 3. Oh well then it's all a moot point. Who the fuck cares? Have a good one, Asylum. Thank you for being here. Right, I don't know how I feel about... I'm just going to play around with the cheekbones real quick. Oh god, no, I'm not. No, 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 look at me. Don't look at him. Why are you looking at him? He's not going to help. Hmm... I don't like the cheek and the chin. Chin height. Can you look can you look over here please? Don't look at him. Why are you looking at him? There's just something off about the face, but maybe we can just, like, ignore it. There's just something... There's just something not right. Chin dip. Hmm. I suppose it doesn't matter, eh? What's everyone's favourite class? Castless Dwarf! <gasps> I'll prep the jail for influx. Might not be too bad. We won't know until we start. It's like massive- it's like a Dragon Age, isn't it? It's like Dragon Age Inquisition. You never know if you've made a babe or not until you get to that first cutscene with Cassandra and Liliana in the jail. And then you're like, mm, yes, made a babe. Maybe we just need to trust the process. Maybe we just need to trust the process. Process? Mish money penny? Profile reconstruction complete. I don't know, there's just something off about the face. I think it's probably because I'm not building a character. She just looks absolutely shocked. He, he looks absolutely shocked. And I'm okay with it. Uh. Guess we can just see what happens. I'm always too distracted during that scene. I feel so bad because I love it. Uh. What do you guys think? Am I just freaking out a little bit? Let's just do it and see what happens. So this is this is how this is the thing. This is all the stuff. Earthborn survivor infiltrator. Soldier, soldier, guns, guns. The only time I'll never pick magic. Guns, 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 guns. Shoot the fuckers. Oh no! They got me! Ah! Oh, I'm 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 down! Oh no! Medic! Medic! They got me! I need assistance! Oh no! Whatever will I do? I tend to choose Spacer for Shepard as it means their mum is still alive. I like snipey, stealthy, stabby, okay? That's fine with me. I like bang, bang, bang. <laughs> I like big, noisy guns. Medic! Let's see what happens. Yeah, I'm not happy with... I'm not happy. I'm not happy with it, but we'll grow. The fact that I'm not happy with it means that I've probably done it right. <laughs> Identification confirmed. Oh god, no. Help me. Casual. Auto level up. Off. Level scaling. 
Legendary mode? What does that mean? Oh, in classic mode, the original 1 to 6 level range will be used instead of the new 1 to 30 level range. XP and talent points uh, point progression remains the same, but the number of levels is doubled. Wait, what? In classic mode, the original 1 to 60 level range will be used instead of the new 1 to 30 level range. Wait, what? So in classic mode, it's doubled. Why? What's the difference? Legendary is just the new edition scaling. So shall we give it a shot and see what's improved? Subtitles on. Auto save the fuck on. Enable tutorials, yes please, because I don't remember how to play the game. In legendary mode it is doubled so you can access more of your skill trees. Oh, in legendary mode it's doubled? No. In classic mode it's 1 to 60. In legendary mode it's 1 to 30. In classic mode, in classic mode, the original 1 to 60 level range will be used. You'll be able to max out in legend. Is it legendary mode and not classic mode? Yeah, but do I get the double points in, in Legendary or, or Classic? I'm not 100% sure either. In Classic mode, the original 1 to 60 level range will be used instead of the new 1 to 30 level range. So it sounds like the 1 to 60, like level 1 to 60 is the Classic mode. Whereas Legendary is now 1 to 30. Hmm. Shall we try out the new Legendary mode and just see how it goes? Sounds like you get 60 levels worth of points in 30 levels with the new. Oh, I see. Oh, okay, let's try that then. Let's try that then. When you word it like that, that makes more sense. You get the same amount of stuff, just the number isn't as high. I understand, I understand, I understand. I understand. Okay, accept. Wait, on, on, on. Auto level up is off, I want to do that. Yeah, casual, legendary. Okay, 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 accept. Oh! We're back. I have no Well, what place. about Shepard? Earthborn, but no record of her family. His family. Doesn't have one. She was raised on the streets. Correct. Learned to look out for herself. Himself, that's right. She proved herself during he the Blitz. Held off enemy forces on the ground until reinforcements arrived. I did my best. She's the only he reason Elysium is still standing. We can't question her courage. His. Humanity needs a hero. And Shepard's the best we've got. I'll make the call. Face looks weird. In the year 2148, explorers on Mars discovered the remains of an ancient uh, space-faring civilization. In the decades that followed, these mysterious artifacts revealed startling new technologies, enabling travel to the furthest stars. The basis for this incredible technology was a force that controlled the very fabric of space and time. No! 
Something, 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 Mass Effect. Jupiter! That's my governing planet. The Arcturus Prime relays in range. Initiating a transmission sequence. Commander? Hello, Seth Green. Hey, Neptune. We are connected. Sup, Baldy? Transit mass and destination. The relay is hot. Acquiring approach vector. All stations secure for transit. Thrusters, check. Navigation, check. Internal emissions sync engaged. All systems online. Drift, just under 1500k. I get it. 1500 is good. Your captain will be pleased. <gasps> I remember Nihilus. I hate that guy. I like that guy. Nihilus gave you a compliment. So you hate him. I like Nihilus. You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Call me paranoid. You're paranoid. The Council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official story. Oh, Nihilus. Oh, no. Shut the f You two need to shut. <laughs> shut up. All right, here we go. Self-insert. Uh... Calm down. You always expect the worst. Well, bad feelings are an occupational hazard. But we don't go anywhere unless there's a good reason, so... What are we doing here? Joker, status report. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link Captain us into the network. Captain Anderson. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we reach Eden Prime. Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here, Lieutenant. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the comm room for a debriefing. You get that, Commander? I heard. I'm on my way. <laughs> Is it me or does the captain always sound a little pissed off? Only when he's talking to you, Joker. And it begins. I'm telling you, I just saw him. He marched by like he was on a mission. He's a specter. They're always on a mission. And we're getting dragged right along with him. Relax, Presley. You're going to give yourself an ulcer. Get, yeah, get your blue suede shoes out, Presley. Talk. No. Put your gun away. Put your gun away. Don't point at it. Put your gun away. Put. Regroup. No. Stop. No. Okay. Cool. 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 Well. This is just great. <laughs> I can't remember the controls. Press Q. I did press Q. Nothing happened. That's what happens when I press Q. Put your gun away, you fool. I grew up on Eden Prime. No, it's not God, this is fine. Put your... Unarm yourself! About this mission. That's crazy. So violent. The captain's in charge here. He wouldn't take orders from a spectre. There's a photo mode now, done. so you can. Spectres don't answer to anyone. They can do whatever they want. Kill anyone who gets in their way. How do I do that? There's too many spy vids, Jenkins. How do I do that though? Fool! Put.
Well, wasted one of them. <laughs> Press start. How? Is there a button for that? Thing is, the photo mode doesn't really work how Bioware intended. You can easily get the camera out of bounds and see things you weren't meant to see. Hell yeah, let's do it. I figured it out! Haha! -ha! All I had to do was uh, press every key on the keyboard. Nope, that's not it. Okay, cool. How do I interact with people? Right, okay, so. Let's draw your gun. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, E? E. I'm thinking E. It's not E. Okay, R. Okay, it's not R. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Uh, hmm. I'm thinking it might be. Uh, time to consult. What the fuck are your controls? Uh. What the fuck? Oh, here we go. Key bindings. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, toggle walk. Toggle crouch. Yeah, yeah. I found. I found that out. I found. I found uh, throw grenade. Yeah, I found that one out. Cool. 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 Cool, 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 cool. Oh god, no, don't remind me about the fucking Mako. Sent you a thing? You sent me a thing. I would never have guessed that. I would never have guessed that. I would never have guessed that. Congratulations, Commander. Looks like we had a smooth run. You heading down to see the captain? Yeah, he wants to fucking see I'm on my way to give him a status update right now. With all due respect, ma'am, maybe he'll finally tell you what we're really doing out here. What do you mean? You think the Alliance Brass is holding out on us? If all we're supposed to do is test out the stealth system, why is Captain Anderson in charge? And then there's Nihilus. Spectres are elite operatives, top covert agents. Why send a Spectre, a Turian Spectre, on a shakedown run? Uh, it doesn't add up. He's kind of hot, though. I mean, like, nanny. What do you know about the stealth systems? I just know Krem. it masks our location from scans and sensors. Cutting edge technology. I did it for Krem's voice. Normandy's the only ship with this prototype drive. But why are we fully staffed? A skeleton crew would be cheaper, less chance of security leaks too. Plus there's Nihilus. It's pretty obvious this shakedown run is just a cover. I sacrifice my pronouns for my voice. I'll look into it. I'll see if I can get some answers when I see him. Good luck, Commander. Don't shout at me. Okay, so I need to go to the place that I totally know where it is. What do you think, Commander? We won't be staying on Eden Prime too long, will we? I'm itching for some real action. I sincerely hope you're kidding, Corporal. Your real action usually ends with me patching up crew members in the infirmary. How's it looking for you guys who are more familiar with the franchise? Does it look better? Does it actually look better? Doctor's right. Only a fool goes looking for a fight, Corporal. Sorry, Commander, but this waiting's killing me. I've never been on a mission like this before, not one with a Spectre on board. Presley there is actually voiced by Dwight Schultz, best known as Mad Murdoch from the A-Team TV show and Lieutenant um, Barclay from Star Trek The Next Generation and Voyager. Nice. You'll do fine, pal. Just treat this like every other assignment you've had and everything will work out. Easy for you to say. You proved yourself in the Blitz. Everybody knows what you can do. This is my big chance. I need to show the brass what I can do. 
Yeah, be, be fucking careful. You're young, Corporal. You have a long career ahead of you. Don't do something stupid to mess it up. Don't worry, ma'am. Yeah, I'm smoother. not gonna screw this up. Oh, this look. oh there's so much better. Cool, 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 cool. Do I want to investigate? Oh, yes, I do want what to investigate. What can you tell me about Nihilus? Turians are generally well respected by the other species. Their fleet has more patrols protecting Citadel space than any other. They don't always get on well with us, though. Some people Her voice find is them familiar. too rigid. Others still blame them for the first contact war. Oh. As for Nihilus, I haven't said more than two words to him. He usually only speaks to the captain. It's I hope we get a chance to see him in action. I heard Nihilus took down an entire enemy platoon all by himself. He can take me down anytime he fucking wants. Uh, guys, roll initiative. If anybody rolls between uh, 17 and 20... I'll do a Morden Sings for free. You're from Eden Prime, aren't you, Jenkins? It's definitely a What's it like? It's very peaceful, Commander. They've been real Eden careful Prime, with development, so you don't have any city noise or pollution. My parents cleaner. lived on the outskirts of the colony. At night, I used to climb this big hill and stare across the fields back at the lights from the main settlement. It was gorgeous. But when I got older, I realized it was a little too calm and quiet for me. That's why I joined the Alliance. Even Paradise gets boring after a while. Why are we going there? Any idea why Eden Prime was chosen as our destination? Not really sure, Commander. Eden Prime's one of our most stable colonies. Good place to take the Normandy for a shakedown run, I guess. No real danger there. There's got to be something else going on. We've got a Spectre on board. That's why I'm so wound up. I can't wait for the real mission to start. You got a 20? So not only did you get a 20, we're going to get a Pio-chan as well? Well, hold on. Instead of Pio-chan, I'll do you a Morden Sings. In prophase you see chromatins condensed to chromosomes. In metaphase their centromeres align to make new homes. Usually I only do two, but because you got an at 20 I'll do all four. Lysine, valine, leucine, isoleucine, alanine. They all are aliphatic, so you will not see your ring. What do you know about the Spectres? Only what I've heard. Spectre agents work directly for the Citadel Council. They usually work alone or in small groups. Spectres don't have any official power, though. Basically, they're a shadow organization with a mandate to preserve and protect galactic stability. Protect it at any cost. Don't forget that part. Spectres operate above the law. Next time I won't do it when there's dialogue on. That was incredible sensory overload for me. They are huge nerds and I I appreciate it. She is the Krogan Queen. Hurrah, hurrah for the Krogan Queen. And, and it is, it is a glorious thing to be the Krogan Queen. I'm so happy. I am the very model of a scientist Salarian. I've studied species Turian, Asari, and Batarian. I'm, I'm quite, quite good, good at genetics as a subset of biology because I am an expert, which I know is a tautology. My xenoscience studies range from urban to aquarian. I am the very model of a scientist Salarian. A uh, babe! Why don't we have any of our own people in there? <laughs> Spectres usually come from the council races. Like the Turians. We've been trying to get a human accepted into their ranks for years now. So far, it hasn't happened. Hey, Commander, you'd make a good Spectre. You're a war hero, right? Held off an entire enemy fleet during the Blitz single-handed? That's the kind of talent the Spectres are looking for. This is all just <laughs> wild speculation. The Spectres aren't interested in recruiting humans, no matter how capable. Well, the captain's waiting for me. Goodbye, Commander. Well, as fun as this was, leave me alone. Even though I instigated that. Wait. Hi, Nihilus. You want to talk about it? Commander Shepard, I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. Uh... What about? I'm interested in this world we're going to. Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. Have a good one, Resident. I did see the, the Natural 20. Instead of doing a Pio-chan, we did a Morden Sings instead. Uh, would I know? Have I been there before? Fuck it. I've never been there. But nope. you know of it. It's become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also Nihilus protect them. Good. But how safe is it, really? Uh, what's your point? If you've got something to say, just say it. Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. 
The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. You're not 20. Was the alliance a while ago? truly ready for this? Do you want a P.O. or a more about time things? we told the commander what's really going on. Mr. This mission Anderson. is far more than a simple shakedown run. Do you want a Do you want a P.O. Chan or a Morden Sings? You can choose for your Nat Twenty. Hey, what's going on? Is someone gonna fill me in, Captain? We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. Wait, what? There must be a reason you didn't tell me about this, sir. Are this you comes sure? down from the top, Commander. Information strictly on a need-to-know basis. Hold the A line. research team on Eden Prime unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. It was Prothean. I thought the Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. Their legacy still remains. The mass relays, the citadel, our ship drives. It's all based on Prothean technology. Sure. This is big, Shepard. The last time you humanity made a ask. discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward 200 years. But Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the citadel for proper name, study. Name their cat Uni. Obviously, this goes beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Why did we tell the Council? Why didn't we keep the beacon for ourselves? You humans don't have the best reputation. Some species see you as selfish, too unpredictable, too independent, even dangerous. Sharing that beacon will improve relations with the Council. Plus, we need their scientific expertise. They know more about the Protheans than we do. The beacon's not the only reason I'm here, Shepard. Nihilus wants to see you in action, Commander. Oh, is it because I'm Scottish? He's here to evaluate you. I'm not gonna lie. If he wants to see me in action, he could have just asked. Wait, do you want me to say it normally, or do you want me to say it like Scottish? Why? What's going on, Captain? The Alliance has been pushing for this for a long time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel oh, Council. Shit, it is midnight. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, Thank you, Celeste. You it shows how far the Alliance has come. You held off an enemy assault during the Blitz single-handed. You showed not only courage, but also incredible skill. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. I assume this is good for the Alliance. Earth needs this, Shepard. We're counting on you. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime <laughs> will be cracking. the first of several missions together. You'll be in charge of the ground team. Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Nihilus will accompany okay, you to observe Mughal, the mission. Okay, no problem. Thanks for being here. We'll probably play some more Mass Effect tomorrow, like all stream. We'll play Mass Effect tomorrow. Investigate. No, I'm good. I'm ready to go. Just give the word, Captain. We should be getting close to Eden. Captain, we got a problem. What is this? What's dream? wrong, Joker? Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Bring it up on screen. Be faster if you just told me what it was. Get down! Hey, Ashley. How's it going? We are under attack, taking heavy casualties. I repeat, heavy casualties. We can't. Get him back. They came out of nowhere. We need. He's dead, Jim. Well, rip. Guess th those guys are a lost cause. Uh oh. Everything cuts out after that. No calm traffic yep, at all. Guys. Just goes dead. There's nothing. I sense hyperfixation. I've been hyperfixating now for almost a week. Status report. 17 minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Take us in, Joker. Fast and quiet. This mission just got a lot more complicated. Fast and quiet, Seth Green. A small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. It's our best chance to secure the beacon. Grab your gear and meet us in the cargo hold. Tell Elenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. Okay. I'm very happy, thank you. You did this! You brought nothing but happiness to me and my stream! 
you Engaging did stealth system. this. Somebody was doing some serious digging here, Captain. You did everything. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in go heavy and bed, head straight though. for the dig site. What about survivors, Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. What? The beacon's your top priority. Approaching drop point one. <sighs> Nihilus, you coming with us? I move faster on my own. Oh, you're so dead. Nihilus will scout out ahead. He'll feed you status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. Understood. Ready and able, sir. The mission's yours now, Shepard. Good luck. Oh. We are approaching drop point two. I exist here now. Ship perimeter secure, Commander. I have no idea. Fuck it, let's do it. This place got hit hard, Commander. Hostiles everywhere. Where? Motherfuckers, where? Guard up. Is that one? I'll get it. No, oh, they're just innocent life forms. We're not here to kill the innocents. All right, let's go. How do I crouch? I remember. That's Death how. Bags. Nailed Don't it. worry, they're harmless. Oh God, what happened here? Hold shift to switch weapons. Oh, hold shift. Always cracking, always. Hit us with the adorable, but don't worry. I'm gonna do this mission before I go to bed. Oh! Don't get dead. That's a red shirt if ever I saw one. Red shirt! Yeah. Fucking knew it. Let's see how the aiming on this goes. Quick, to the red shirt! Oh no, not red shirt, Richard L. Jenkins! Rest well, red shirt. Right through his shields. We're out of chance. Don't look at me like that, Caden. It's not gonna happen. Uh, I don't want to be an arsehole about it. <laughs> I'm gonna be an arsehole about it! He deserves a burial, but we can't help him now, so forget about him. How do I pick all of the options? Um. Okay, 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 okay. We'll have someone come and pick him up. We'll see that he receives a proper service once the mission is complete, but I need you to stay focused. Point at his nipples. Aye, aye, man. Uh, that's Sir, thank you. Cool. Oh, that's right! Paragon and Renegade! Totally forgot! Alright, okay, okay, okay. Look at me, Paragoning. I'm so far Paragon. Look, I'm not gonna pay attention to your medieval bullshit. <gasps> you bastards! It was just an innocent creature minding its own business! How dare you! Dash. Got some burned out buildings here, Shepard. A lot of bodies. Right. I'm gonna check it out. Hey, Nihilus, I'll try to catch up with you at the dig site. Nihilus, don't be a fucking hero! Don't get smart with me! Quick! Creatures, get out of the crossfire! Ah, we must run through! So that the creatures will be behind us! Ah, I'm saving the day. No, creature! No! Oh, you fool! I warned you! Oh, cool. Thanks, Caden! He has a nice cadence about ma! Okay, nailed it. Is that, is that fucking bright enough? Slipping. I am 
the very model of a modern major general. That's a lot of hours. Well done. Ow. Oh, oh Christ, Ashley, for fuck's sake. He's dead, Jim. Oh, that's what you guess for wearing red. Never wear red on an away mission. Uh, please, please get dead. Thank you. Appreciate it. Love it. Thanks for your help, Commander. I didn't think I was gonna. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one who charged here, ma'am? Sir, uh, I was looting, but sure. Are, are you okay? Are you wounded, Williams? A few scrapes and burns. Present Nothing serious. The, the others Duke weren't so lucky. Far oh, man. I'll look we in a minute. Hold on. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. <gasps> what happened to your unit? Where's the rest of your squad? We tried to double back to the beacon, but we walked into an ambush. I don't think any of the others... I think I'm the only one left. What killed them? Any idea what kind of enemy we're facing? I think they're Geth. The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. I Why said the Vale. here now? <gasps> burp? There's Burp? They must have come for the beacon. I'll look at Burp before I go the to bed. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. Take us there. You're coming with us, Williams. We need that beacon. Aye, aye, ma'am. It's time for payback. It's sir, but cool. Uh... Nihilus? Have you seen a Turian Spectre around here? There aren't any Turians I Have a good one, villain. None that I've ever met. Not sure I'd be able to tell if one was a Spectre anyway. Uh. If you saw this guy, you'd know. Carries enough firepower to wipe out a whole platoon. Luckily, he's on our side. Sorry. Like I said, no Turians. Cool, 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 cool. Cool, cool. Move out! Cool, cool. Cool, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Press escape to go to the squad. Squad, okay. Uh, squad. Cool, cool, cool. Right. Uh. Pistoles, obviously. Pistoles, soldier. Uh. Double soldier? Double soldier. Nailed it. Do it. Uh, Sentinel, Sentinel. Fucking eight. Soldier, soldier. Cool. Nailed it. Nailed it. I will do a save. Oh, whoa. Double soldier all across the sky. <laughs> Oh, that's unfortunate for this. Oh, wait. Oh, give it, give it, give it, give it, give it. Uh, to change your blah, 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 blah equipment. Oh, 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 oh. I can't remember anything about it. Where is it? Ah, we'll figure it out later. I've got no time for this! I have a Turian to watch die. Move to the edge of cover! Okay, cool, cool, cool. the thing. Can I leave the thing? Can I leave, I leave the thing? 
left control. Alright, calm down, lad. Everything's fine. Actually, um, let me explain how guns work, babe. Let me let me just give you a quick wee a quick wee uh, tutorial on how guns work and how how you should not be doing that. That's exactly what you should not be doing. I'm a little busy here. Yeah, yeah, yeah fuck off. Oh god, hi, it's me. Don't mind me. Just here hanging out. Right in the dick. Got to, got to get a dick shot in at least once. I'm quite good at genetics as a soft cell biology. Might as well start getting that uh, inventory full. Wouldn't be a game with uni if uh, we didn't this have that the inventory full. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the Geth? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. Any survivors? You think anyone got out of here alive? If they were lucky. Maybe hiding up in the camp. It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. I thought only Italian robots had dicks. Plans, Shepard. There's a small spaceport up ahead. I want to check it out. You're I'll a small you spaceport. I mean, okay, Nihilus, whatever. Double checked for loot? Looks like they hit the camp hard. It's a good place for an ambush. Keep your guard up. God, they're still alive. What did the Geth do to them? Made them angry or question mark? Oh, hello, sir. No, sir. Stop. That's enough of that, sir. That's right. That's what I suspected. Fucking. Stop that, stop that, stop that, stop that, stop that. Who else wants to be shot in the dick? I've got bullets. Shoot y'all in the dick. Hello? I'm here for the dick shots. Ooh, and that. Uh, attack. Ass, ass in. Hey, Caden, how's it going? Oh, nope, stuck. It's fine. But what's round here? What could possibly be round here? No oh gods, it's still alive. No, it's worse than that. Okay, game, calm down. Wanted to see what was up in there, but fine. Saren. Hello, big boy. Nihilus. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? <laughs> Cracking. The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Oh no! I liked him. He seems smart. Yes. Is there a problem? Would you like that to door. It's closed. Security locks engaged. Yes, but what if? Oh no. Oh, I remember. Meant it. No. There we go. Humans. Thank the maker. Wait, what? Hurry. Close the door before they come back. What game are we playing? Uh, who the fuck are you? What are you doing here? I'm Dr. Warren. Jen. I was in charge of this excavation. We hid in the shed during the attack. They must have come for the beacon. Luckily, it wasn't here. It was moved to the spaceport earlier this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. 
They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses will remain. Do I still have my Dragon Age armor, out of curiosity? What's wrong with your assistant? Manuel has a brilliant mind, but he's always been a bit... unstable. Genius and madness are two sides of the same coin. Yeah. Is it madness to see the future? To see the destruction rushing towards us? To understand there is no escape? No hope? No. Some people confuse I one for the other. I am not mad. I'm the only sane one left. I gave him an extra dose of his meds after the attack. Can we do anything about them? Williams, take us to the spaceport. You can't stop it. Nobody can stop it. Night is falling. The darkness of eternity. Hush, Manuel. Go lie down. You'll feel better once the medication kicks in. Oh, yeah, sure, sure. Just like fucking so. Yeah, just. Sure, sure, sure. Meds will solve everything. Sure. Right, well, time to go and uh, hate this. What is that? Off in the distance. Your maw? Shit! Look at the size of it. Uh oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Sorry, I was taking in the scenery. Caden, what do your elf eyes see? Where are they? We'll never know. There they are. Find them. In the deck. 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 Go that way. Fuck it. Yeah, good thing Caden's here. Pretty sure Ashley's helping, but pretty sure it's all Caden at this point. Wait. I didn't panic. You guys panicked. Everybody stay calm out there. We're coming out. We're not armed. Is it safe? Are they gone? Uh, sure. We took care of them. Those things were crawling all around the shed. They would have found us for sure. We owe you our lives. Uh, Surprise! I still can't believe it. When we saw that ship, I thought it was all over. It showed up right before the attack. Knew it was trouble the second I saw it. So we made a break for the sheds. Tell me everything you remember about the attack. The three of us were working the crops when that ship showed up. We just saw it and ran. I don't know what happened to the rest of the crew. They were by the garage, over near the spaceport, right where that ship came down. No way they survived. You don't know that. We survived. If they made it to the <laughs> garage, they could have had a fighting chance. trouble when it blew in. Because our comrades are lying dead on the cold, dark ground. What else can you tell me about the ship you saw? I was too busy running to get a clear look at it. I think it landed over near the spaceport. Tell them about the noise, Cole. That awful Cole. noise. It was emitting some kind of signal as it descended. It sounded like the shriek of the dam. I am really sleepy. Oh, I'm going to do this quest. It was coming um, from inside your own head. This mission and then just kind of like go to bed. It was probably trying to block communications. Whatever it was, it felt like it was tearing right through my skull. I'm full of life right now. It almost made it impossible to think. I have to go. Hey, Cole, we're just a bunch of farmers. These guys are soldiers. Maybe we should give them the stuff. Jeez, Blake, you gotta learn when to shut up. You have something to tell me, Cole? Some guys at the spaceport were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing major. In exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages in our sheds. Like what? What kind of packages? I found a pistol. Figured it would come in handy if those things came back. But you'll probably get more use out of it than we will. Thanks. This should help. Let's move out. They could probably do with a pistol, Good to luck. be fair. I'll just double check that you weren't lying. Fuck you, st storage locker. Ah, yes, that was Krem. Yep, all Krem. I, I sacrificed my pronoun so that I could have Krem's voice actor. It feels right. 
I don't mind correcting. <laughs> I don't mind correcting um, the pronouns. It's good practice for when I'm in IRL and I need to correct people. Z my pronouns. Anyway, where's this guy? I'm gonna fuck him up. <gasps> Not Nihilus. It's Nihilus. Is it? Something's moving over behind those crates. Is it your mom? Wait! Don't don't shoot! I'm one of you. I'm human. Uh. What are you doing sneaking around back there? I am sorry, I was hiding from those creatures. Mm -hmm. My name's Powell. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. Wait, what? I need to know how Nihilus died. English is his first language, The lads. other one got here first. He was waiting when your friend showed up. He, he called him Saren. I, I think they knew each other. Saren. Your friends seem to relax. He let his guard down, and Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. Yeah, sure is lucky that we have a first-hand witness account just right there and stuff. We were told a Prothean beacon was brought to the spaceport. What happened to it? It's over on the other platform, probably where that guy Saren was headed. He hopped on the cargo train right after he killed your friend. I knew that beacon was trouble. When it walked in? It's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I hadn't been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. Uh, uh, the the Geth Ranger? How come you're the only one who survived? Why didn't anyone else try to hide behind the crates? They never had a chance. I, I, I was already behind the crates when the attack started. Wait a minute. You were hiding behind the crates before the attack? The quest is almost I... over. Sometimes I need a nap to get through my shift. I I sneak off behind the crates Relatable. to grab 40 winks where the supervisor can't find me. You survived because you're lazy? I mean... Lucky break for you. If you hadn't snuck off for that nap, you'd probably be dead just like all the others. Yeah. Yeah, I guess. I'm not nap shaming him, don't worry. I don't really want to think about it. All right, I, I will actually. We need to find that beacon before advice. it's too late. Take the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. I, I, I can't stay here. I don't I actually remember how long this quest is, so I will. I'll pause here. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. This will be where we pick up tomorrow. This will be where we pick up tomorrow. Come here, good boy. <gasps> in prophase you see chromatins condensed to chromosomes. In metaphase their centromeres align to make new homes. Lysine, valine, leucine, isoleucine, alanine They all are aliphatic, so you will not see a ring For bases you have arginine, lysine, and histidine From protein we are formed Now be aromatic! Tryptophan and tyrosine and phenylalanine Aspartic and glutamic are both acid and glutine For MIC, asparagine, and also glutamine From protein we are formed oh. She is the Krogan Queen. Hurrah! Hurrah for the Krogan Queen. And it is, it is a glorious thing to, to be the Krogan Queen. I am the very model of a scientist, Salarian. I study species to a Asarian Batarian. I'm quite good at genetics as a subset of biology because I am an expert, which I know is a tautology. My xenoscience studies range from Earth to I am the very model of a scientist, Solarion. What a babe! By the way, guys, Ace in chat is the very reason why I have Morden in the first place. It's because of Ace. Ace was the one that donated Morden to the stream, to me. So you should probably go and thank them.